Benny, sum up uh, 20, 21 for me. Uh, shortened season, but you guys gave it everything you had and ends up with the division title. A uh, memorable year. It was a lot of fun, and uh, it's a group I'm going to remember for a long time. We had a, a great year and uh, definitely finished the way we wanted to uh, with, a, with a win in our last game. Your third full season in Bakersfield, uh, you wore an A this year. It seemed like you took a lot of pride wearing that A and, and kind of developing your leadership and, and being a voice uh, in that dressing room as well. Yeah, at the start of the year, it kind of was a little bit shocked. I mean, we had a lot of leaders in our dressing room, but uh, Woody told me he wanted me to take a step in my leadership role. Uh, I got to learn from some great guys uh, with Brad and uh, Stan. So it was a fun year, and I mean, I just tried to keep growing my leadership uh, every day. Offensively, defensively, uh, just uh, as a season uh, for this uh, team, but for yourself personally, a point per game guy, uh, proving yourself again at this level. Uh, when you look at the season for you individually, obviously, it wasn't call-ups, there wasn't that this season, but from a team aspect, you certainly have to be proud of, of what you did here in Bakersfield. Yeah, no, for sure. I mean, all three years so far I've been here have been, have been great years. And then I guess just looking at this year, um, big thing for me that uh, took us so far was just the chemistry I had with two guys in Cooper and Ryan. And once Ryan got called up, uh, we just kept going after that. It was, it was, we had a lot of success this year. And I mean, the, the most important thing was uh, just that last win. Uh, that was a lot of fun. And being able to win the Pacific Div Division with this group was awesome. Yeah, take me through that uh, that Saturday for you guys. Uh, we obviously didn't know what the division was going to look like, uh, you know, the intensity of the games, but everything ratcheted up a notch, and it certainly seemed like a, a big weight and a big opportunity there at the end uh, for you guys to be able to to call yourselves division champs. Yeah, no, we worked whole, hard all year. We didn't know what uh, the playoffs were going to look like at the start of the year, but uh, once it finally happened, we knew we wanted to win it, and uh, we, we were fighting all year to do it. And uh, just to be able to call ourselves champs at the end of the year is uh, just – Shows how hard we worked all year, I guess. This team had the top penalty kill in the regular season. was good in the postseason as well, too, especially in game three. You were a part of that this year. And, and adding that, uh, you know, Jay kind of talked about adding that tool to your, to your belt this season as you progress forward. How important was that to add a little more dynamic uh, aspect to your game in terms of being able to kill penalties uh, on a regular basis? Yeah, that's something at the beginning of the year that uh, me and Woody had talked about, just to kind of... Just for me to try and make a jump, that's an area that I might need to have that will make me help me become an NHL player. So just to be able to do that uh, this year and improve that part of my game was big. Go into this off season. It's a shortened off season. Uh, certainly, playing to the end of the May uh, will do that for for you guys. But when you look at this off season, big year for yourself, big off season for yourself. Uh, what are your kind of your thoughts uh, as you kind of unpack things and get things ready and moving uh, back to Edmonton? Yeah, no, I guess uh, just take a little bit of time off. It was a long season, um, but uh, I'm ready to start working and uh, getting back in the gym to make sure that uh, once I show up for camp, I'm ready to try and make the team up in Edmonton.